I'm Matt. And I'm Christina. And, and this, this is Dota, Dota 2. 2. Okay, so this is a new series uh, that uh, me and Christina are trying out for fun. Uh, we'll see if this uh, people like this. We'll continue. But this is a replay of a game that I played recently. And, uh, oh boy. It was such a, a disaster, a shit show. That... 100%. Um, I have a lot of feelings about this game, and 50% um, of them are bad. So. Yeah. Uh, um, uh, especially this Chaos Knight, which um, I don't play Chaos Knight, but I don't think this person plays Chaos Knight either. Yeah! <laughs> I mean, they could be doing an all-hero challenge, but this is, um... Lion. Interesting. <laughs> so... Well, I don't think they are, because I think this was the one we looked up, and they played, like, 12,000 games or something like that. I don't know how that works, because yeah. after 12,000 games, this should definitely be second nature. Yes. Um, um, oh! We should mention that this is the latest patch, which is 7.34. 7 yes. Uh, so there's a few things that have changed. Um, Wait, let's take this Night Stalker skin. Peep the outfit. Oh, yeah. Peep the outfit. I'm really sad they don't do skins anymore. Like, well, as much. I mean, as much. Yes. Um, That's what I look forward to when I play Dota 2 is the fashion. So. Absolutely. Okay. Okay, so we are looking at the player view. And you're playing Warlock, by the way, right, yes. for the audience out there. My uh, talented husband is playing Warlock, and oh I think this is this is a pretty good game. Yeah, I so, think you played a pretty good game. And thank you. Uh, so everything we're seeing right now is what the Chaos Knight saw. Oh so this boy. Is, so that mouse is his mouse. Okay. I would love to see what this build <laughs> is. So I thought we would follow him for a bit, and then I can switch it into pre, uh, pre camera. Oh boy. Okay. Uh, pretty much whenever I want. Wow. And we'll look at the last hits and denies. Okay. Yep, that's a really good indication on what we're going for here. Yes. So. Um, okay, I mean, he's by the bounty room, so, so he's, far, he's doing good. solid placement, okay. solid, solid placement, so, you wanna, you know, you have a couple space, more than a couple spaces, I think, what, four spaces for a bounty room? Uh, yes. Yeah, four spaces for a bounty room, um, and, you know what? Let's and oh, here, yeah. So. Okay, there we go. And, uh, nobody is by them. <laughs> 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 uh, by these bounty runes, everybody's just free for alling. The Slardar is dead, dead. Um, th th there's the bounty rune, and not one person on the other team cares. And then there's a dead Night Stalker. So we already got two kills, and we are 15 seconds in. We love that. Yes. Uh, let's can I do directed camera? Maybe directed camera is what I want. Yeah, I think that. Okay, so. Uh, that was the big fight at the beginning, and that helped us really put... Oh, nope, the directed camera seems to not keep it on player, so I will go back to player view. Okay, well, let's just see what this Chaos Knight's all about. Because this is the part... We're going to focus on mostly Chaos Knight, because, yes. um... Incredible. That's all I can <laughs> say. <laughs> incredible play. Absolutely. Um, th this Sand King, though, pretty good. Like, yeah, yeah. I, I, yeah, like, you'll see, you'll see. I'll, and, I'll commentate more on And this his... was our first game of the patch. So we yeah. just read the patch notes. Uh, I found that the Warlock had some changes to his Q uh, for Fatal Bonds. So that's why I wanted to try him out here. And I think we'll see it right here. Uh, that's why I'm focusing on hitting creeps at the moment, is that I'm trying to see to create little tiny demons. And see how they actually work in this one. And right now, you know, Sand King is doing. There it is. There's a the little guy. Yeah, the little golems <laughs> are, are very cute. Very cute. I, I like them. Or little imps. Sorry, they're imps, not golems. Um, but they look like little golems. Though. They, they, yeah, they pretty much are. And I just don't want to get canceled. Um, <laughs> so I'm gonna say imps. Um, 
Uh, yeah, this Chaos Knight is getting its butt kicked. Yeah, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Um, that, that's all I got to say about that. Um, maybe let's look at some other lanes, possibly. Sure. Like, let's see what mid has to offer, or a top is fine. Mid, mid's great. Um, yeah, this Luna, I have a lot of feelings about her. Um, that's all I have to say about that. I have a lot of feelings. Um, we have a Lich and a Dawnbreaker up top with a Muerta and a Night Stalker. Mm -hmm. um, I think both of these teams are fairly matched up, I think, quite equally. Um, this is Lich, the doing work uh, in the beginning here. Like, you can tell. So, 0 4 lead. I just think that the teams are pretty equally matched. Like, sometimes when you're playing Dota, you sometimes, you're on a team that's not equal as the other team. So when the match was going on and people were picking their um, heroes, it was very close matchups mm -hmm. to one another. Yeah, I felt I felt like the teams were pretty even this, this game. Yeah, yeah, me too. And uh, by that we mean that there's enough... Uh, people you have each in game there's an early mid and late portion of the game and some heroes uh get stronger at different parts of it and i feel like we had a, a nice balance of on uh, each team where they each had strong early mid and late game heroes yeah and you know chaos knight and lion are, are pretty too strong hero support you know mm -hmm. um you know lion with his finger stacks i mean once he gets up there, he's critical, you know? He, he can really do some damage on you, so. Um, you know, this this should be a, a big, beefy team-up with this Chaos Knight and Lion, I I think. Yes, no, um, I agree. You have a melee, you have it's, a range. Like, this is a good lane, because this is right, a you great have a melee, lane. you have a range. Great. And, and honestly, you know, now that we're seeing this replay, this is the first time we've seen the replay, by the way. Um, like, he actually has a good build so far. Like, you, as a Chaos Knight, uh, you could do 102 or 111. Right. And I've never played Chaos Knight before, um, so uh, all I know is he is one big boy. Yes. <laughs> um, so, yeah, when you're playing against a Chaos Knight, you know, he can make copies of himself. He hits hard. When yes. He, when he You're gets not. built, he, he hits pretty hard. So, um, yes. But the big thing about him, especially right now, is that he should be able to stay in lane at all times because his third ability here, uh, Chaos Strike, gives him a percentage chance, which is a 33%, 33.33%, to give him 30% of the damage that he does as a critical yeah. uh, heals him. Right. So... He should be staying in lane constantly, and you can see it when he does those big slaps like that. Um, this should be like an easy, I think personally, an easy lane with a Sand King and a Warlock. Um, I I think compare. I mean, there there's a big, you know, difference. I think. I mean, Sand King can do some damage. Let me tell you. Oh, but uh, okay. <laughs> we love the couriers, guys. Uh, couriers are fun. You didn't but, even do anything with the couriers. Um, it just looked at him. I mean, okay, we've got technical difficulties. So we're starting to now get to a point where now it's like one for one, one mm -hmm. for one right now. Um, so right now, uh, Lich has the most kills and eyes, and then there's Warlock second. Chaos Knight is not even in the running. Should be at the top, I believe. Yes. Um, uh, actually, I should be doing last hits and denies. Yes. Uh, yes. Yeah. Sardar, okay. And then Sand King. Chaos Knight third. Not the greatest, but we're Man, here. I, I'm surprised Luna is so low in her last hits. Uh, well, I'm not because she's not good. <laughs> I'm the water. Um, so there's that. Um, I'm like. Matt is more of the. He plays Dota 2 very frequently. I play Dota. I watch Dota 2 way more than I play it. Um, so, this is just how I see it when I'm watching him play Dota. Um, oh, so now here comes the Slardar in the lane here. Yeah. 
Yep. You should be of, looking, but... There's a lot of feelings on the Slardar. Uh, so... What, like, what are we doing right now? So we happen to know, know that the Slardar was here because we can actually see him by the center floor. Yeah. Um, I didn't even realize he was invisible this whole time. I, that, not a good job of it. Yep. Because he went right past that sentry ward. Yep. So now, since he kind of blew his cover, there's nothing they can do. So what I'm doing here is that I'm pulling our lanes in. And this is when they start to notice. So they're trying. I feel like them. if you're going to gate, if you're mid and you're going to get um, mid. Yeah, that was that was my bad. I I, I still think more. that the Sand King should not be tearing Chaos Knight anymore. Um, no, you're absolutely right. He should. Be. I no. I don't know. I, I don't know the build of Chaos Knight. All I know is like when I have played against the Chaos Knight, it never ends wow. well. <laughs> so if so, this guy doesn't have any items that are queued up here. Otherwise, we'd be able to see them. Yeah. Um, I believe I'm, tower is hanging on by a brick. Maybe it doesn't show that on here. No, no. Yeah, yeah. It, it shows it on for just. You know the one. The almost one... everyone in this game doesn't have a queued item. Um, yeah, I, I don't understand that. That is the one thing that when you introduce me to Dota, you always taught me to queue up items and recipes, and as you get the money, you just send your courier out there to get them, or, you know, whatever, and they come to you, um, just so because it saves you time. Mm -hmm. So you're not, like, having to be stopping and looking for your guide or whatever. Yeah, so at this point in Chaos Knight's build, this is where I would queue up. So, this confused me because why is Chaos Knight in mid now? And Slardar is just like, yeah, I I'm chilling bot now. I don't know. You go and gank and then you go back to your lane. And it looks like, and I said this to you when we were playing, that yeah. why is Chaos Knight in mid right now? What is happening? Um. What happened? And then Slardar goes, oh man, I forgot I was mid. Right. And yeah. <laughs> that's, that's... He's like, oh man, I'm not mid anymore. And it's just like crazy, you know? Uh, there's, I would love to see the chat on the other team. Yes. Like, what is happening? There is absolutely, like, no communi- like, no communication. Yeah. Um, with, especially with Chaos Knight, I feel like he's already died twice. Okay, so we're, we're using our little ability to make copy That's his ult, right? Yes, that is his ult. Yeah. Like I said, I'm I'm not a, a Chaos Knight player, so um, this is this is not my hero. <laughs> no, that's fine. So I, I just, I'm looking at the knowledge I have just of the game in general. Um, um but yeah, so... I, yeah, I think you're doing a great job with everything that you know and what you've seen. Okay, so we're... So... I don't... I mean, yeah, okay. So I try to steal his uh, his kill here, but I am just too weak. To <laughs> oh, yeah, I mean, a, a big beefy boy with with a, a warlock. Yeah. Well, I mean, Sand King's Sand gonna King. come to your rescue yep. right now. Oh, oh that's yeah. when we saw the item. So I tried to ult him here. To try to prevent him from getting all that. I mean... To his credit, I would have done the same thing. I oh, would've... I mean, 100%. There was like three... There's three bounty runes there. I mean, oh yeah. yeah. So, this is the confusing part to me. Because he now has... Um, enough gold. Or, sorry. So, now that he's got the power treads, he starts into a staff of Oblivion. Um, I don't know what that is. It's... It's not even like here. Let's let's pause it for a second, and we can open up the actual shop. Um, this is the I would have I would have gone for something beefy like a a bracer. So uh, okay, so something. he's probably building an echo saber at this point, which is good because you want to hit multiple times. So the more times you hit, the more chance you're able to get, get your crits off. But what he should have been building here 
is an armlet. Armlet, that's what, not a bracer. I'm sorry. No, no, you're fine. Something beefy boy. So this is the, at least from my knowledge, the quintessential build for Chaos Knight. Just after the power treads, you start working on armlets. The helm of the Iron Will will prevent you from being pushed out of lane immensely. I also know that Chaos Knight has a, his other two core items are a Blink Dagger and a BKB. That I've seen before. Uh, yes. Where he blinks into a fight and then activates his BKB and just beats you to hell. Now, sometimes they don't even get the BK, uh, the blink if things are going bad enough. Yeah. Uh, and so that they'll still just use their. Uh, but this guy is risk. just getting, getting absolutely pummeled. pummeled by a Sand King. And this Sand King's beefy. He's the not. Very beefy. I mean, he is the highest GPM right now in the game. Yes. Which is, um,. Can you put it back to last hits? Oh, yes, of course. Um, yeah, he's second in last hits, and he is creeping up Slardar. I mean, very quickly. I mean, it's gonna surpass him in, in last hits. I mean, Chaos Knight is like 20 last hits, 20 plus down last hits than uh, Sand King. Yeah. So and that's shocking. I mean, he should be, I think he should be like farming, you know, those so small camps and Lane. but he just keeps getting pummeled. Yeah, and you can see now in the network, too, that the Sand King is the highest because he's been getting the most hits, last hits in the lane, and he's also just been racking up these kills. So, at this point, it's looking bad for the game. So he's got to do something to, to start helping his lane out, or helping the other lanes out to really start pushing this game. Yeah. The Slardar is tried, but the Slardar has failed. Yes. Yeah. So they see me here. But there's not much to do. You Little do they know, though, the uh, the is that we actually have uh, wards up here, so they can't. Uh, so we're able to see everything they place. Ooh, I did not see them place this one down. Yeah, Lion Crafty there for a second. Yeah, so the Chaos Knight should have definitely come back in to save him. Oh, that's not gonna happen. But he did good to avoid the Sand King's ult, but then he should have came back in to go and save his buddy. Right. Um, maybe we should look at some other lanes. Oh, uh, hold on. Oh, oh, we have Slardar coming in, just... Yeah. Oh yes, this was him with the double damage. Yeah. So they come rushing in, but because Chaos Knight was there too late because of just miscommunication, they're just they just gotta run. <laughs> this chat must be lit on the other end. Yes. Um I yeah. Well, we we saw a couple minutes back that he actually opened up like the chat team menu, so he might have muted everyone. <laughs> he might have, you know. Um, cause I a lot of toxic. I could. I could see some toxic stuff happening, but um, I love how they hex your little ball. Yeah. Uh, so that was my bad. I I should have been there. Uh. I I thought Saint King was behind me at that point. But your little golem is gonna do some work. Yes. Yeah, so now I'm controlling the golem. Here. <laughs> And <laughs> we just pick up kill after kill. Totally worth it at that point. Oh, yeah. One for three is always a good uh, takeaway. So we got Night Stalker. Which I haven't even seen him in any of the nights. He should have gone out to the different lanes. Like, he shouldn't be farming right the now. The one thing I never saw him do in this whole game was use his ult. If we look uh, back. Yeah. I never saw it because it those little spinny hands that go around, mm -hmm. which is his uh, um, crippling fear. Crippling fear. I never saw that once in this game. Uh, so that so that's just his normal one of his normal moves. No, his, his ult. Yes, his ultimate is uh, just, uh, Dark Ascension. There you go. It's like the hands are all around him. He does. Uh, no, that the hands all around him is actually one of his abilities. Oh, abilities. okay. Uh, that right. is the uh, that is the crippling fear. 
Okay, I never saw him use that once. Yeah, so... Which might have been helpful for him. Yeah. Top tower, so, uh, for him, his ultimate elevator. is that it turns the place night. Oh, okay, and yeah. And you'll see up here, when uh, they're doing the night there... Um, wait. Hold on. Let's... Oh, no, I was in the wrong player view. Let me, uh... Go back here. We're still trying to work out the <laughs> Yep. Looks like the Dyer figured out where Radiant's top tower is. Hope Dyer's middle tower is insured. Uh, the thing is standing on its last brick. Okay, there they are. <laughs> but your main focus for Night Stalker is you really want to gank at night. Yes. You farm during the day and you gank at night. Yes. So, you know, that should that's your whole thing. And I don't see a lot of that happening in, in this game. I, I may, I'm, when I was watching you play, I maybe saw him like twice in your lane, or just in general come to you guys. I don't know what was happening there. I mean, this poor lion is trying. I mean, okay, so this is the time. Yes, you, you should be getting in there. You, you got. Yeah, so like, this is good. This is good. I mean, this is what he should be doing. Yeah, this is. But he is just not strong enough for this. Cool. Yeah. Well, especially because yeah, Sand King is now. Strong. I almost called him Squirt King. <laughs> Man, I need saving. <laughs> oh, have you ever seen the the rock movie Scorpion King? I yeah, uh, am I not a Mummy franchise lover? Yes. You are. Is that is that part of the Mummy franchise? It is. It's a prequel. Wait, really? I did not know that. That's how in the second Mummy the armlet. Uh -huh. It's the Scorpion King. Radiant might want to haul some ass down to their bottom oh. tower. Oh, they still got one. Oh, that's it's cool. like a prequel before the second movie. I did not know that. And to I think the first Mummy movie. Anyway, <laughs> fantastic cinematic feature, 1999 cinematic feature featuring Brendan Fraser. <laughs> it really is though. Anyway, back to the game. Yep. Um, okay, yeah, I, I like what's going on here. This is good teamwork with the Slardar and the Night Soccer. I'm going, yep, yeah, that's the right idea. Here, I mean, this is like some good kind of communication here. We're, yeah. We're picking off heroes. They, they should have been doing this every time the night went off. This is what they should have done. Yes, and yeah. Take advantage of the knights. The knight that is what night soccer is here for. Um <laughs> I, I I really can't justify being over here right now. He finally got a tier one token though. Yeah. Will he make it from a token to a regular item, guys? <laughs> that oh, is the oh. question. It looks like he's clicking. Uh well. Maybe not? Okay. Okay. No, no, you did. It okay. took him a, a small a small bit. That's good. Uh where is Luna's? Okay. Uh oh, keep an yeah. eye on Luna's tier one token there. <laughs> it uh, newest flash, it doesn't change. <laughs> so this new I think this came out when the whole map got reworked. That big the big rework for Dota 2 happened. Did they change the tokens then? Uh, yes. Okay, so you click on the tier 1 token, and it gives you options, and then you click on the one you want, and it puts it there. People have not gotten that. It's like wisdom runes. It's just... They haven't figured it out yet. Um, and it's and it's just amazing. If you've always hated Radiance Middle Tower, I have good news. To see. Yeah. I mean, you guys have, like, your team has pretty good communication on where to go. And we weren't really communicating either no like, I, think I mean through pings and things like that but you know just normal stuff but none of us were in a group from my understanding from this game yeah now see another good game there So they overstayed their welcome just a little bit, but overall, I think that was good. Yeah, I I agree. Oh, okay. oh my goodness, comes, this camera. Comes okay. Chaos Knight. Again, I would have waited. I mean, good. Okay, good teamwork. I yeah. can't fault them on that. I can't fault. Them. No, I think that was good. Uh, Luna using her ult on a. So, 
So, like, Night Stalker could have used his ult there. Yeah. Uh, well, it's daytime, right? Oh, oh, I see, I see. No, you're, you're right, you're right. It's daytime, so that's, uh... No, no, so yes, he was in his powered-up state. So now he should be using it right now. Because he's in a weakened state since it's daytime. And he may have gotten that Luna kill. Right. There's just, like, a lot of initiation, but no follow-through with the other team. Yes. Um, Chaos Knight's just like, look here, I'm just gonna jungle wherever I can. <laughs> I mean, I, he's, he's, this is the most I've seen someone utilize a map, though. <laughs> Honestly, yeah. Honestly, oh my gosh, look at this Lotus Pool. That's <laughs> disgusting. People I, don't use the Lotus I did use the Lotus Pool. I think at all of this I don't really think you needed to. Your team kind of cleaned up top for you. This poor Chaos Knight is just... his. He is only at level 10 at 21 minutes. Like... Wolf. Yeah. And, I mean, you can you can see our health bars and stuff on top here in the replay. Like, I was pretty much constantly full at all times, so there was really nothing I needed uh, to do for the... Uh, Lotus's. You know what? This Muerta was not bad. No, game. she was pretty good. She was pretty good. I I think she, her yeah. item build's really good. Yeah, she's got a great little item build here. I mean, I like I said, I don't play Muerta. Um, I haven't got a chance to play Muerta yet, to be honest with you. But I, I think from all the games I've watched and people's builds, this is pretty solid, right? Oh yeah. You got your Maelstrom, Power Treads. So, uh, we were doing Roche here, and you just Oh my god, himself. I can't even stand this Chaos Knight. So... Like, why? 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 I don't know. I don't understand I what the thought process I thought he had his team behind him, here. but they, did, they weren't even... Oh, uh, there was no communication here. We... Yeah. There is absolutely... I mean, good on this Muerta for trying her best to, like, to get yeah. to get kills. I mean, good good on her. She's the only one with some sense, mm -hmm. I feel. But everybody else, just running into the Roche pit is insane yes. when you don't have backup. Like, the whole team's there. Yep. And then you see those little spikes that are coming out of the ground there? Yeah. That is a Sand King's Aghanim Scepter. Okay. That that changed a few patches ago. Uh, it's kind of like Lashrak. Lashrak? Yeah, uh, yeah. Lashrak's like little sticky things yep. on the ground. Yep, it's it's pretty much exactly like that. Um, so now it turns his stand, Sandstorm into even doing even more damage. Isn't that also his Aghanim Scepter, Lashrak? So the little spikes come out of the ground, icy spikes come out of the ground? Um, so they changed that recently. Oh, okay. Uh, in the that's, actual That's how much match. I know about Lashrak. But, I mean, no, no, honest. you're right. Yeah. So uh, what it used to do was that his uh, ult, his pulls, uh, his Nova pulse that is his ultimate. Uh, when you had the active scepter, it also did the lightning strike okay. with it. Um, but now they changed it to. Uh, I think it's a whole new ability. See, the problem is now. This was, was this was good. That yeah, this is good. Yeah, there's nothing I can do, so I'm running away. Muerta is using her ult as a really great defense against your team. Yes. Um, but right now, Chaos Knight, I, I, he, all he has is a Overzax, is that what it's called? Yeah. So I think he's getting I, a BKB. But you know how hard it is for him to get go. I mean, okay, finally, someone gets the Lotus. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Healing. <laughs> um, but it, it's hard for him to get any items because he keeps constantly dying. Right. He's four, eight, and two. Yeah, he, <laughs> that's not good. <laughs> and, and look at our network too. Uh, oh it's yeah. Pretty much our whole team. Yeah. We're up four K at this point. But it's really the the Chaos Knight just doesn't do enough damage, nor is he deep enough at this point to really help out in these fights. And the Sand King is just zoning everyone out with his ultimate. 
Oh, oh, did he get the kill here? Oh no! Oh. Oh, that's so disappointing. Yeah. And let's see, it's night time. Let's see what uh, Night Stalker's doing. And he's far. Great. <laughs> Uh, and he's getting a Heaven's Halberd? I guess for Luna? But Luna's not the problem here. I am confused. <laughs> and, Luna, uh, Luna is not the pro- yeah, it's Sand King. <laughs> yep, and she's got the tier 1 token, she's got a tier 2 token now, and she's got a recipe, which she should have held off on buying the recipe and bought the ultimate floor first. That is a common mistake. And, like, how many tier to She has one in her backpack. Uh, yeah, she's got she one has... in her backpack and one sitting here. Yeah, right just unused. For now. <laughs> I mean, until she was screamed at four million times to use her token. <laughs> yes. uh, I don't know if that will show or not. Uh, we'll, we'll have to see. So, see, he could have bought... If he didn't buy the uh, Ogre Axe, yeah. he could have bought the Armlet right he has enough money for it. Yeah. And that would vastly increase his uh, farm and just his survivability as well. Hmm. Um, also, there's a new mechanic in Dota uh, in this patch. Um, it's called Slow Resistance. Hmm. So, and now the armlet gives you slow resistance. Uh, before, it was just a regular debuff resistance. Uh, now they've changed it to where there's actual status resistance to for everything. And then there's actual just slow resistance on its own. So a lot of items have now been changed to incorporate slow resistance into it. Uh, which I think is good. Because uh, there was a lot of confusion up to what is considered a status and what is not. Uh, because slow was kind of its own thing. Mm -hmm. So now they've explained it. So I didn't realize this, how useful this was, but having Warlock slowing Aura here and then having uh, Lich's ultimate to bounce between people works so well together, if you can pull it off. And the only person alive here is Chaos Knight, and he's just running across the whole map, trying to come back to the bank. Yeah, what what's he doing? He got a haste rune, so I don't look now, but I I had I don't know what he's doing. Oh yes. So I mean he's trying to come back. Okay, so he's coming back it. to try to Okay, well But by he's <laughs> by himself and he just figured out the whole uh, yeah, he goes, I'm screwed. I got Dawnbreaker whips it. There's a whole lot going on. I mean, your team's like, we don't care because, uh, and then he's like, let me try to get in here, don't defense, no, my team, my team comes in five seconds too late. This whole Slaughter's Courier is just in the fray. <laughs> what is happening? Just chilling. I can't believe nobody killed his courier. Yeah. That, okay. You're right next oh to it. Gosh. Okay, I have how to roast you. How did I not you. notice this? I have to roast you. I'm so oh sorry. My, how did I not notice that? Okay, now someone finally kills oh this courier. Oh my gosh, it was there the whole time. I it was, was there. It, was it bug, tried. But... This Sand King is MVP, my dude. I mean, just a monster. Now, He's beefy. So, now, I want to point this out. Uh, we just missed it here, but... Up here this whole time during this entire fight, yeah. when Chaos Knight was running back to us and everything, yeah. he but there was a, a creep lane right at this tower. He could have been with this creep lane fighting in this tower, and nobody would have known the wiser. Right, and he could have gotten a tower, or it would have forced us to come back to go defend the tower. Right. So it would have pulled one or two people away, and then he could have came down and helped his team. No, but right now they're a barrack down. They're a bottom tower down. A, ba a bottom barracks down. Um, you know, I don't know. There's just absolutely no communication with this chaos thing. And I, I can only imagine the absolute obscenities that are happening right now. I don't even want to know. But his team must be pissed. Yeah, and he did get a BKB. Yeah. <laughs> Does, I don't think I ever saw him use it once, though. It's for show. That's 
That's kind of what I'm thinking too. I okay. Okay, we got tier three items coming out. Uh, so now she's got a tier one, a tier two, and a tier three wow, token. Wow, we got the whole. <laughs> We got the whole set, guys. Uh, I think this is around the time when I started to notice that she had all of them. And I started uh, telling her, hey, please activate them. Uh, and, and she still had no idea how to activate them. No, but she never responded or anything. There's nothing in this Chaos Knight build that is... And also, can I say something else? Yeah. He has two freaking lotuses, like a greater lotus... A, healing, a greater healing lotus and a healing lotus. I didn't use one in that whole fight. Yeah, you're right. Tower. He just letting you know. Like, there is a... Use them! Have, they're just taking up space and then he could have put... I mean... Why are we still have the broom handle in the backpack? Put that away in the tier 1 token pile. I just don't think he understands. I, I mean, I don't know. He's played 12,000 games. Yeah. Sorry to the person that I, I hope you're. I, this is just construction. Construction criticism, mm -hmm. dude. I am so sorry if you're watching this. I don't know if you are. But, you know, this is what we come across when we play um, unranked games, even ranked games. This is just the pool of players we have, and we just comment on them through our own eyes. Yep, and I think this. That lich was out of position. Yeah, so I am standing like right here. The slaughter sees that. Oop. You are definitely out of position. Yes. Yeah, that's on you. That, that's on you. I, now that I'm going back through this replay, I realize there's probably three times I've died here. Uh, Dawnbreaker was the only person besides, I think, the Sand King have a beat, Gaby? He does not. No. Dawnbreaker was consistent with her BKB. Yes. She turned that on ASAP. Yes. Uh, a lot of players, they get a BKB because they're like, that's what I should get. And then no one ever activate, activates it at the right time. Yes. So. And she also has, for her Aghanim Shard, her Q ability, the Starbreaker, the one where yeah. she spins around in a circle. Yeah. That has uh, mm -hmm. a BKB built into it as well. And so, she is aggressive, too. Yes. She is an aggressive player, which is good. You you want, you know, at this time of the game, it's 33 minutes. 33, right? Yeah, 33 yeah. minutes. You want to be a bit more aggressive. You're trying to end the game. Or you're trying to, you know, get a good lead. Yeah. And at this point, we're definitely trying to end the game because we have the good lead. Does that say you're up 12K? Go that up is 13 now. Oh, yeah. my God. That is crazy. <laughs> the amount of just... I'd love to see this side and to see what Chaos Knight is trying to go through. I, I guess he was just farming this whole time. But the problem is, it's just his build's not good for farming. No. If he had an armlet, he could be farming so much faster. It, and there's something about toggling the armlet that Chaos Knight players do, right? Yes. Yeah. Um, so every time you activate the armlet, it gives you strength, health, which for since he's a strength hero, it also gives him damage. Yeah. And now the slow resistance. And but you lose, I think it's around 30 HP per second. So that's why you want to turn it off every time you're moving from spot to spot, and then turn it on only when you're in fights. Wow, you a lot of money. Okay. Yes, yes I am. Wow. Look at you go. Okay, so yeah, Night Stalker and Chaos Knight. Night Hunter, damn. <laughs> Yeah, you're worth some money. Um, okay, couriers are just out in the open in this game. What is wrong? I just don't think Slardar knows how to use a courier. You just press X and you press it, and then you press it back, right? Or whatever. Yeah. Whatever, whatever letter. Button you have it sorry, to. I use X for yep. mine. I press X and then I press X again and it comes back. Yep. Like, hello. <laughs> the courier. Slaughter's courier is just out there. Well, and so the you're, what you're using is you're using just the call courier button. Yeah. Which, so you press X, it just comes to you, and then you don't even need to do it. I'm a BB. I'm basic. <laughs> no, that's I, the best way to do it. Like, I, I, that's the same way I use it all the time. Don't ask me to do anything fancy with my career, because I will not. Uh, no, you're doing everything fine there. Um, 
It's just that. Uh, it's just that uh, what they're doing is that they're going back to the fountain, clicking. They're going back to the fountain, clicking on the courier, yes. and then they're dragging it over. Oh, also, there's just a token in the middle of the fountain there. We love. Hi. Uh, yep. Yep. So this is actually the enemy's token. Oh, okay. Uh, so if you steal an enemy's token, so that means someone let the token just sit on the ground. And that always happens, too. Yes. I have too many times that I can count. Okay, so you guys are taking this out. Th this poor Muerta is, and this lion, they're really trying. I mean, good for them. MVPs. Mm -hmm. Like, this poor lion, though, he gonna die. Yep. He, he's low. I mean, not too low. But yeah, they're just trying. Those two are really trying to defend their base. And Chaos Knight is just like, I do not care. And so Night Soccer's doing the right thing. He has the movement speed, the increased movement speed. And you're just running away from a fight that you're not going to win. No. It's not happening. No. I, I tried uh, to use my Glimmer Cape there. But I'm. Just... I mean, good on this Dawnbreaker for, like I told you, she puts her BKB on and she's aggressive. She's got a really aggressive playing style. Does it work for her? Not really. <laughs> Do we love it though? Yes. Yeah. Those Slardars. I didn't know that this was happening. No, me neither. I mean, but. That explains why Sand King wasn't in that fight though. Sand King? What, what happened? Okay, he got stuck. Okay. Oh, but then he just runs away. <laughs> This is what I don't get! He's Why like, oh man, going? I didn't kill him in one! What? what is happening? Go! Go! Oh my gosh. What is happening? This is... Okay, good teamwork, guys. Oh this Muerta is the only competent player. What was the same king doing there, too? Like, why? Why is Chaos Knight putting his BKB on, like, after the fight is done? <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's he, what I like to know. He put this BKB on for a 4v1 fight. Oh, he did use his greater healing, Lotus. <laughs> oh, there we go. It took him 15, 20 minutes, but we did it. I mean, this Chaos Knight's trying to get the right idea. Hit some towers, but he is not beefy enough. He's no. just not. And then here we go. This Dawnbreaker, she puts, she comes in there, BKB on, like she should be, and she just rips the new one. Yep. And uh, let's take a look at uh, uh, Luna's items. And yep, still got the tokens. Yep. <laughs> oh, this is, this is, I <laughs> just had enough. <laughs> I'm like, please, for the love of God, <laughs> swap out your token for something. She thinks about it for, she's thinking about it. Uh, so what she's doing there is that she's turning that outpost back oh, to ours. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, no, but she's she's going oh, yeah. she's gonna look at that advice and be like, <laughs> I'm going to the secret shop, guys. I'm going to fill my backpack even more Yep. Uh, when I could have two more spaces available for me. I, she could also sell this <laughs> She's trying hand. to move stuff around. Okay, so, she's, so she couldn't figure out how to move it, so she just sold it. I mean, honestly, she should just sell her Wraith Band. She, yeah, she, yeah, no, you're right, the, actually. It's the time of the game At where you don't need is. that. You're I almost 40 minutes in. You don't need a Wraith Band. So, but please... Okay, we got, we got, four, we got four tokens. <laughs> We've got the complete set, guys. We've got the complete <laughs> Pokemon card set. She oh, literally has the, the complete set. Tokens. And then she finally turns it into a fate approach. But then that's it. She, She's like, I'm good. She's done. I I've got my. I, I, I did what I needed to do. Stop <laughs> yelling at me. I mean, cheers. What are you going to do? Yep. Uh, we still got our broom handle in our backpack. I mean, Luna's almost six, slot, six slotted for no reason. Yeah. Um, Chaos Knight's dead. So we used his DKB correctly. Yeah. 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 She's so weak at this point. Dogbreaker really be coming in with she really thinks she's gonna get a kill and she will. Um <laughs> good buyback from her. I mean good buyback from her because she got a kill. That's all I gotta say about that. Um You guys are pushing, which yeah. Uh so this is when I realized I had so much money. Oh, yeah, you're you're angry. Yes. 
points. It's just because we keep winning fight after fight. Yeah, well, and you're killing a lot of... Or getting assists, too. Yes. Uh, so. so, I also got uh, on my talent tree level 20 just now to summon a golem on death. So, every time I, I die, it summons a new golem. Which I didn't know this, because uh, I think I went for an item scepter next. Which the item scepter allows me to summon now, two golems. Okay, so when you die, because you have the Ag Scepter, right? Mm -hmm. Or, no, you just have the Shard. I have the Shard. Okay, now. when you get the Ag Scepter, you get two golems plus if you die. So that means you get three? So I thought it would give me four, because I'd activate my ult, create two, then die and create another two. Right. But it turns out it just, when I die, it just gives me the regular golem. So, yeah, so I come out with three in this game. You know, what's kind of interesting is, like, no one looks at the mini map. I feel like in games because there could have been Chaos Knight up at the top with that big yes. old creep wave and Push then try out. to get that top tower. Yep. But nobody is actively looking to where the creeps are on the mini map, so it's a little hard. Yep. And so now he got a heart because he realized that he was not tanky enough. But, but it's too late. It's too late at this point. He's we're ten. We're we, sorry. We're. Excuse me, we're 5-13-6. We're way behind Oh, man. Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, uh, so, okay, so she had a shadow blade here. Wait, this is... Do we want to be... Yeah. So this is where we realized that Boruto was strong. Oh, yeah. But she was starting to... She's the tanky girl. <laughs> yes. she, was, she, she was starting to just destroy my goals with these. Oh, uh, yeah. And, I mean, she's taking a beating right now. Mm -hmm. And she's still... Yeah, she was in the game. Yeah. No, she did good. She helped defend it there. Now, no, yeah. She's why, trying her best. She's... Why they are leaving... When there is, when there's, they're all dead. Radiance Middle Tower is Back yeah. Me here. Um, and maybe because they thought that Lion and Night Stalker were pretty close to being back in the fountain, if you're a fan of ready Radiance to go. Top tower, I shut my eyes. Guess, um, that's the only thing I could think of. I don't know. They just, it looks like they just pushed back to farm. And... I don't know. I, I can't tell you. What, what was going through their minds at that point. But, I mean, you guys are harassing and doing what you guys need to do. Mm -hmm. This Sand King is really tanky, though. Like, he, he could take a beating. This is where I see that we just need to kill the tower. Yes. I mean, look at how low that tower is. Yes. So, I've got and the And this items. is also when Sand King was telling you just hit that tower. <laughs> so, I die here. Oh, this is hilarious. And... Dude, this is what I think. Oh, no. No, no. That one's coming up. Okay. But, so, this was where I, I got the, the tower, at least. This, and the Sand King was furious, like you said, where he was just like, you guys need to hit the tower, you guys are all dumb, I hate you. And we're just like, dude, I got the tower, it's fine, and now I just need to group up and focus on the barracks, because we got the barracks in the mid and bottom tower. I mean, though, they're not... I don't um, this... The Sand King was saying that... Or maybe, a, yeah, it was like kind of picking up all these wizard rooms. And what's killer is like ever since this new map came out and the Tormentor and the wizard rooms have been there, hardly either everybody picks them up in a game or nobody picks them up. Yeah. And that's a real game changer because that gives you a lot of, um, gives you a level up, essentially. Pretty so much. It, it helps you get to your stats a lot quicker. And so, I mean, this Chaos Knight could have really used some wisdom <laughs> yeah. I mean, he's getting the bounty. I mean, this team is really good at getting the bounty runes. 
Yes. They, I will have to say, they're on those. it with the bounty runes. They kind of are like, okay, this spawns here, this spawns there. Whatever. And you know, they really pulled back the the gap, too. Look at the map here. You can yeah. see the network is really starting to change up after these few fights. It's a, there's a lot of peaks and valleys in this game. Mm -hmm. um, the Slaughter, now, as you can see, yeah. he does have the Aegis um, under him. So... Which I didn't know when I was watching this game that Slardar had even roached. Yes. Um, we were so unaware of that because, as you can see, it doesn't really help. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Which it should. Um, so, I don't know. So, this is... So, like, this at this point, Warps oh, should this be poor pushing... little lich. No, honey. Ugh. Out of position by himself. Yeah. I mean, well, that's not where you should Oh, but look at this. Yeah, he's getting pummeled by the tower. And I by mean, his that's, cross. that's very disappointing. To, like, lose your Aegis almost to a tower. Okay, BKB is on. Good defensive move for Chaos Knight, but it's just not going to be. No. Dawnbreaker. So he's a little tanky combo. here. He's able to yeah, he's able to withstand some damage, but it's not enough. It's not. I, I've seen tankier chaos nice. Oh yes, absolutely. you know where they could they Very could sure. withstand that whole fight. Oh, I mean, why this guy's more a little more tankier than that chaos knight. Stalker. Yeah, why isn't he grabbing the double damage? We have no <laughs> idea. Because I think he's waiting for... He could be waiting for Slardar to get it. Yes. Um, But Slardar is proving himself not to be the... I mean, they're on it with the bounty room. Yeah. Um, uh, he's proving not to be a good carry. Right? Because yeah. he's position one. Right? Um. No. So technically, because he was mid, he should be position two. Um, okay, well, right now he's Night position Stalker one. Should be one. Okay, 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 okay. I can see that. Uh, but in their network, it's Slardar who is one. Yeah. Uh, actually, it's Morta. Actually, maybe Morta was one. But, anyways, we got the fight here. Slardar dies. His spear, you know, he has not used his spear. Is that a second ability or a Uh, second ability. Okay. He, he used it. Once. So, this is where Murta kills us. Oh, okay. I think this is the part. Oh my gosh. This is hilarious. Yes. <laughs> okay, so. I, we've been waiting for this moment. <laughs> oh, okay. So, we, uh, we just lost that fight. And... It's looking not... I mean, it's not looking good. It's We're only good. up by 3k, so yeah. it's not... So here's the Chaos Knight. So here's my three golems. I start coming in to hit him. He activates all... And then he leaves. We have no idea why! <laughs> Just like... Um... Well, okay. And this poor little <laughs> lion is like, what is happening? <laughs> this poor little lion. I mean, and your golems are pretty tanky. At this point, I've got the... Oh, I don't even have the, the item yet. There's a plus 20 armor. So, yeah. I mean, and then great. Lion's like, I'm out. I, I have nothing else to do, brother. <laughs> you can't do anything and I say thank you. <laughs> so what is going on? Is this Chaos Knight? I have to follow him. Okay. Let's, let's is pull he this trying back. to get a wisdom root? Like, why? Let's pull this back a little bit. Okay, I gotta know where he goes. We're gonna follow his trajectory. Yeah. I'm curious. Oh, okay, so he's... So he's he, he had blinders on. Yes. And he just said, I can get a guaranteed kill here. Oh. Oh, no. That's not good. Oh, and then oh. he tried reality rifting him. Top barracks just fell. Oh, but then he sees him. Can it is down. tunnel vision. <laughs> this <laughs> is feral tunnel vision, guys. Oh, my gosh. Oh, and he tries to do it again. Radiant probably oh, could use those my barracks. gosh. He just really wanted that kill. <laughs> he really wanted to prove himself. Oh. So that's, that's what happened. Okay. 
he really just wanted that kill. God, and he could have prevented the Mega Creeps from being spawned. I love that he got tipped. The Lich got tipped. <laughs> that's a beautiful, that's a good tip. Because, <laughs> and Lich did nothing spectacular there. He just ran away. Yeah. I think this chaos, I think this person probably doesn't play chaos that a lot. And this could possibly be why they But that changed the whole trajectory of the game right there. Yeah. <laughs> me too. That's because I told you to. Yeah. <laughs> Toxic wife, wife behavior. I forgot we did that. And they've definitely pulled it back again. Yeah, yeah. I now, mean, now we're only up to 4K. Yeah. So they're doing a. They're, but I think it's the Muerta that's really. The Muerta and the Night Stalker are really trying their hardest to win the game. Yep. Um, the Slardar. No hope. Um, and the Night Soccer also has the same problem with the tokens. Except he actually activated his, but now he just keeps What does he have in his backpack? Oh, uh, he just keeps him in his backpack. Yeah. Why? Uh, I, I don't know. I, I just cannot. I, there's no reason to have tokens in your backpack. They, I, do they do anything if they're in their no. backpack? No. And <laughs> this is... Here we go, Luna. That's where all our tier fours were. Oh my so at one point she realized, got rid of the tier three and tier two, but then just accumulated the tier fours. I think that's just spite behavior now. Uh, she got mad. I have a feeling. I mean, I don't know. I don't know what, I don't know. If you're watching this, Luna, I don't know what you were feeling, but I feel like you were spiteful at <laughs> that moment. <laughs> or you just didn't know, which is fine. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not fine, but it's fine. Yeah. The lion did the same thing. Yeah, uh, yeah. The tokens are been really hard for Pete. Slardar so. with his courier. <laughs> sorry, I hate to say it. it's just so annoying. I'm so sorry. This courier is every. Just keep the courier where it belongs. Okay, going to the secret shop. <laughs> We'll keep that, we'll keep that out there, see if he actually buys anything. I can't stand Slardar as a player, I'm so sorry. This makes me feral. Yep, they got the Luna. They were coming after me for a bit. Oh, but then I, I ran to the team. I'm still on Courier Watch. <laughs> Nothing's being bought. I'm feral right now. I'm so mad. <laughs> oh my god, it just sits there. I feel like you should know where your career is is at all times, and how you should buy things. No, no. Hey! hey! Oh, hold on, hold on. Let me pull that back. Ten seconds. So he stops here, looks at his career, <laughs> and look at his health. <laughs> He's already being attacked because he didn't know what was going on. Oh. Oh, that's so bad. And then he is he is out for a hundred seconds. Yeah. All because he was he couldn't figure out his curse. My brother. My brother Christ. <laughs> I, I this 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 slaughter made me feral. There was there was a lot. It was a lot. lot. And his career died like four times. Yeah. Three times, four times. We should, uh, this game, we should have put a courier count of death. <laughs> it was obscene. Obscene. Yes. Hey, you got, okay. I want to know this. Why are you men obsessed with not hitting the count? <laughs> you guys are like, we'll track up so many kills. It's like, at this point, like, just end the game. And it, and it got us killed here. Yeah, because you guys are being toxic. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's just... She should not have this Penta Edge sword. No, I, she's trying her best. Look. But, you know, we don't know what her other tier items were, so yeah. maybe there was nothing else to it, but... Well, everybody has them in their backpacks. So yeah. she had to take what she could <laughs> yeah, get. That's true. They're all in that backpack, so... She's like, look. <laughs> she She's like, look, oh. I have to take what I can get. The Why are we activating, activating the BKB in the fountain, bro? <laughs> Oh no. Oh, no. He activated his BKB in the fountain. 
Oh. Buddy. Oh, that's tragic. Buddy. That's tragic. That's. Yeah, I mean, Night Soccer has two tier items in his backpack, so they could have been tier four. Yep. Or tier three, or Muerta's just trying her best, okay? Mm -hmm. She's probably like, look, I'm stuck with a bunch of idiots. No, I can't I can't fault Muerta for this at all. No, no. I, I just don't understand the Heaven's Halberd. I, it was for the Luna, I guess, but... Mm -hmm. Oh, wait. Do we see him? Is he Roshan I don't think he's the... No. I think he realizes this. Maybe he doesn't. Maybe this is just him being toxic. It's toxic trait. Was this happening? <laughs> he is. Okay. And then again with the wisdom runes. Yeah. <laughs> <It's> again. <laughs> this is happening the whole time. Does he? You know what I wonder? I wonder if he thinks because he's beefier at night that he could take on Roshan by himself. Uh huh. Is that what the thought process I, was? I bet it was. And it, he was like, no, I, I'm actually, I can't do this myself. Oh my gosh. Uh, yes. Oh, I'm buying a uh, hex. Oh, okay. Uh, Psychobice. That Muerta this Muerta is horrible. a beefy girl. Yep. Yes. <laughs> no one noticed that <laughs> they were losing the tower. Or not the tower, the Mountain. fountain. Okay. Yeah. That's that that was game. Yep, that was that was a game. Yeah. That I don't want to watch again because that just hurts my heart. Yep. That poor Chaos Knight. And so we'll show the, the stats here at the end. Because uh, I, I know personally, I'd love to see the stats. <laughs> I still had four. I... And a tier one token. <sighs> the lion had a tier two activated. Okay. Here's the thing. So, when you activate a token, the only way to activate it is to put it into the actual token slot. Sure. So what the lion did was that he took out his tier two Put the tier four in there and went, nah, bro, the tier two is much better. And put it back. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> he also did that with the Titan Sliver, too. All those are much better than this, what is it, Ring of uh, Aquila? Aqua, Aqua? So, like, it's good. It's a good tier two item. But sure, it's for, not, like, it's, ten minutes into the game. Right. It's not, it's not good as Aesthetic Cap, where he could be getting a debuff to be able to run out of places, like run out of fights, which is the whole thing. Like, you don't need the extra agility no. <laughs> as Lion or the mana at this point. No. You just need to finger. And <laughs> he had a Agnum Scepter. Yeah, he had an Agnum Scepter, so he could finger the whole the yep. whole team. And I mean, honestly, if he, if he played it if he played it right, he could have done some damage. Yeah. Oh my god, you wailing on that Chaos Knight. Oh, not, not the seven that, times. That poor Chaos Knight. Not the seven times. Seven times. I didn't realize it. You know what's crazy there. also? Hmm. <laughs> Lion only bought four wards. Maybe six. Yeah, six. The six wards. Throughout that wow. whole game. I, While wow. Lich is at 12, 23, two dusts, and one... Smoke. Smoke, yeah. And then you bought some 15 and 11. Mm -hmm. And there, I mean, Slardar, Slardar. bought more wards <laughs> than Lion. If you're looking at this, Slardar is the support. Yeah, right? Yeah. That's why I'm like, he's not, he's not doing the work of like a tier one or a tier two hero. Yeah. No, I don't know. I don't know. <sighs> but I think we're going to call it uh, there for this one. Yep, and it was a very interesting game of Dota. So, um, if you guys want to send your Dota games to us, uh, you can uh, send it to us on Discord. I will put a link at the bottom of this video uh, for our actual Discord server, and we'll have a new section on there of uh, videos that you can send. And then uh, every now and then I'll take a look at them and I'll pull a few. 
So thank you very much for watching, and we will see you guys next time. Bye! Bye!